The utility sector involves companies that provide basic amenities such as water, electricity and gas. To describe them, you might use words like steady or boring. You probably wouldn't describe them as exciting. But that's exactly what many of these companies are. They're having to modernize rapidly to keep up with changing industry dynamics to the point that not investing in this sector risks missing out on attractive growth opportunities. Let's take a look at two key trends in utilities. The first is cost parity. Renewable energy is now cheaper in many cases than power from fossil fuels like coal. This makes it ideal for meeting countries' growing energy needs. We know the world needs to decarbonize to mitigate climate change, but to move the needle on climate change, we need to focus on operators with large-scale generating capacity. In short, size matters. So who's best placed to bring about the changes required? Arguably, it's the utilities companies, which have the industry expertise and can put the cash flows their fossil fuel businesses still generate to good use. The second trend is energy security. Russia's invasion of Ukraine has shone a spotlight on energy security in Europe and reawakened a desire for energy independence. Renewables offer the most probable solution given their cost advantages and the fact that they can be installed domestically. This offers another potential growth driver for renewable energy. Crucially, there's an ecosystem of companies potentially in line to benefit from this growth. This comprises companies that transmit renewable energy via dedicated green corridors, for example, or technology companies able to upgrade grids to facilitate increased penetration of renewable energy. So why consider utilities companies? Investors can find some of these companies trading at attractive valuations, often lower than headline names associated with decarbonization, such as electric vehicle manufacturers. Some are hiding in plain sight. Legacy utilities companies transitioning to renewables. They're leveraging their skills and balance sheets, but with valuations that reflect old world operations. This should interest investors due to the potential for them to re-rate. With the market valuing a utilities company as a renewables operator with growth opportunities, rather than as a fossil fuel operator without. We call this transition alpha. We see utilities as a sector with investment opportunities. As active managers, that's exciting. More than that, engaging with utilities companies to drive the transition to renewable energy offers a potential both for financial returns and improved societal outcomes.